because nobody is increasing his salary and his strike is the following I'm not going to do more miracles until today we see miracles in the year 2008 by the name of the, of the Lord Jesus Christ and this is how God proved himself his miracles never stop our God will never refrain from sending miracles not like your God because he is false he is making excuse and his excuse is very filthy stupid and full of lies but I will play a video happened every year from 2000 years until now in the empty tomb of the Lord the Messiah Jesus Christ where a, where, where a light and a fire come out from his tomb in the eastern day and see it and tell me what it is about it's the holy it's coming out look look at it look at it look every year from 2000 years until now and we challenge anyone where this fire is coming from you are an atheist you are a Muslim you are a Buddhist you are a Hindu go and watch it by yourself thousands of TVs cameras A simple man believes anything, but a prudent man gives thought to his steps. A wise so if anyone tells you, there he is out in the desert, do not go out. Or, here he is in the inner rooms, do not believe it. For as lightning that comes from the east is visible even in the west, so will be the coming of the Son of Man. Wherever there is a carcass, there the vultures will gather. سنريهم آياتنا في الآفاق وفي أنفسهم حتى يتبين لهم أنه الحق أولم يكف بربك أنه على كل شيء شهيد we shall show them our portents on the horizons and within themselves until it will be manifest unto them that it is the truth. Doth not thy Lord suffice since he is witness over all things?
studies of the Quran and Hadith in the last four years have revealed a system for classifying human embryos that is amazing since it was recorded in the 7th century AD. As far as it is known from the history of embryology, little was known about the staging and classification of human embryos until the 20th century. For this reason, the descriptions of the human embryo in the Quran cannot be based on scientific knowledge in the 7th, 7th century. The only reasonable conclusion is that these descriptions were revealed to Muhammad from God. He could not have known such details because he was an illiterate man with absolutely, absolutely no scientific training. As a scientist, I can only deal with things which I can specifically see. Uh, I can understand embryology and developmental biology. Uh, I can understand the words that are translated to me from the Koran. Uh, as I gave the example before, uh, if I were to transpose myself into that era, knowing what I do today and describing things, I could not describe the things which uh, were described. Uh, I see no reason, uh, I see no evidence for the fact uh, to refute the concept uh, that uh, this individual, Muhammad, had to be developing this information from someplace. Uh, so I see nothing here in conflict with the concept that uh, divine intervention was involved in in what he was able to do. <laughs> Many of the people of the scripture long to make you disbelievers after your belief, through envy on their own account, after the truth hath become manifest unto them. Forgive and be indulgent toward them until Allah give command. Lo, Allah is able to do all things.